the primary school head teacher. Morning to you in morning Manchester. Job. And also Emma Louise Cullen, who's the mum of Libby, who's here. Good morning to you. Morning. Libby, you are looking very smart this morning. You've passed our, our very high threshold for smartness <laughs> on this sofa. Thanks for making the effort. Mum, if you'd got this letter from the head teacher saying kids are dirty and unkempt at your school, what would you think? A bit insulted, I think. Insulted, uh, yeah? Yeah, I think so. I think if um, she's got problems with particular children, I think maybe she should be... Um, if perhaps then affecting learning, is it not justified in some way? Um, uh, Amy, it's about how you approach, and if you're concerned, if you're a head teacher and you're concerned, you're seeing kids come in, they are unkempt or dirty, school uniforms not being maintained, and you feel it's bringing down education standards, their standards. I would say I, I love school uniform. I want to see children coming in smart, ready for, ready mm. to learn in school. But I would want to be working with partnership in parents and the way that we would tackle it at my school would be to work with those parents on more of an individual basis, to be asking questions. Do you need some support? Is there an issue at home while you're not getting your children into school rather than coming in with a more harder line? But as a head teacher, have you ever been tempted? You see maybe some kids coming in and, and they don't look... I would have a chat with the parents, I think, John, definitely, and I would be wanting to um, sit down and work out, because sometimes it's the child that's being defiant and not wearing their uniform, sometimes it's the parents not being organised and stuff, but I think it's important to have that conversation, because if we as a school are setting that standard, it's our job to work with the parents to help them meet that. I guess it's the, the language that's used in this letter, isn't it? It's words like dirty and unkempt, which I think have made people... Listen, it's not just talking about the, the uniform not looking smart. What, what do you think when you, when you read the tone of the language, Emma Louise? I just thought it was quite tough, really, and I think... Uh, two. Two. <laughs> two. We've lost two skirt, two, three cardigans and two skirts this year. Rummaging through the lost property, oh, looking gosh, for labels. Oh, just one big red pile of lost property at Been school. There. Libby, what, are you happy to wear school uniform? you like it, or would yeah. you rather be able to wear your own thing? 